Hi guys, this is Joe. We dump 1.92 million tons of waste every year. What is our role in waste management and how dangerous is it globally? Wastes have posed a significant threat to our environment. We can do our part by practicing the three R's of waste reduction. Reduce, reuse, and recycle. Individually, we can start small. So in this study, I will just focus on one waste, which is metallic dust waste. Since I am from the civil engineering department, I will try to apply civil engineering in reducing, reusing, and recycling metallic dust waste. In this study, we will try to utilize metallic dust waste as a substitute for fine aggregate in concrete, fine aggregate meaning sand. This would help in a way to reduce the strain on the environment caused by the increase in demand for construction materials, while at the same time reducing the accumulation of this kind of waste. Scary as it sounds, metallic dust wastes are known to be hazardous because it is conductive, combustible, and explosive. Upon checking, there are very limited studies that use metallic dust waste in civil engineering application. So this is a great opportunity for us to explore if metallic dust wastes can help us in improving the strength of our concrete. But to know, we must do our experiment first. In our study, all the procedures were done following the ASTM standards. We did the ASTM grain size distribution curve, moisture content, specific gravity, unit weight, absorption, concrete mixing, concrete curing, and concrete testing. So basically, we did everything in ASTM standards. The metallic dust waste used in this study were gathered locally from the blacksmith houses or Pandayan in the Philippines. The metallic dust waste gathered are observed to be fine in texture which is comparable to sand and has a reddish hue due to the presence of rust. The results of the laboratory experiments were used to compute for the concrete mix design with a target strength of 3000 PSI or 21 MPa to meet the minimum requirement for structural members. To give you a background, concrete is composed of water, cement, admixtures, coarse aggregate which is gravel, and fine aggregate which is sand. We will try to replace the amount of sand in this study. Replacement percentages are composed of 0% as our control specimen, 25%, 50%, and 75% for metallic dust waste. 6 inches in diameter and 12 inches in height concrete cylinders were used for testing for their 28-day strength. Results show that the unit weight of metallic dust waste weighed 13% heavier than sand. It is therefore concluded that substituting sand with metallic dust waste by volume would result in a heavier concrete due to the metallic dust waste having a higher weight than sand per volume. The moisture content of the fine aggregate is 0.65%, while its absorption is determined to be 4%. During the actual testing, it was observed that the metallic dust wastes require more water due to its fineness. Lastly, to determine the compressive strength, we used a universal testing machine. The results were, the compressive strength of concrete increased about 17% when 25% metallic dust waste were substituted for sand, the average 28 day of the control specimen is 34.53 MPa. The 25% substitution yielded 40.28 MPa, which is the heaviest. The 50% substitution exhibits early strength gain during its first week of curing, 29% higher than the control specimen. The specimen with 75% substitution has the lowest performance. It only exhibits 28.4 MPa. Based on the previous studies with similar materials, the increase in strength is caused by the finer particles. The finer particles act as microfillers which lessen the void and transition zone between aggregate and paste making the concrete more impermeable and improves the paste to aggregate bond. However, increasing the amount of metal dust would mean an increase in the number of fine particles in the mix. In the mix. Metallic dust waste require more water causing an increase in absorption and reducing the actual amount of water available for active materials to hydrate. This is the main cause of a decrease in the strength as the volume of metal aggregate in the mix increases. Let's wrap this up. The effect of partial substitution of metallic dust waste as a fine aggregate in concrete were investigated in this research. It was found out that after 28-day curing, samples with 25% substitution yielded a higher result. The optimal substitution rate must be kept at the 25% level. Whew. 
We've learned something new today. Metal wastes can replace sand in an optimal amount which in a way can help in increasing the strength of concrete. Therefore, we can reduce, reuse, and recycle metallic dust waste. Do you have any suggested material that we can use in our research? 